Have you ever stopped to consider how your work affects the lives and well-being of millions of consumers locally and globally? Whether you manufacture feed, transport it, or raise meat and poultry, decisions you make every day play a large role in determining how healthy food animals will be and how safe the food produced by these animals will be. Consumers want assurances that their milk, meat, and eggs are safe to eat. So I can't overstate the importance of safe feed in your jobs. Let me give you an example. If you use corn and poultry broiler feed that's contaminated with aflatoxin, which is a natural toxin produced by mold, you can see reduced weight gain and feed efficiency in your birds. If you feed aflatoxin-tainted corn to lactating dairy cows, unlike with poultry, you may not see obvious health effects on your cows, but the milk produced by those cows could be dumped if found unsafe because of high aflatoxin levels. And it's not just naturally occurring contaminants that can cause problems. Man-made contaminants can affect feed safety too. Just a few years ago, an ingredient supplier purposely added melamine to an ingredient to make pet food. Many cats and dogs were seriously harmed. And before the problem was fully revealed, the adulterated ingredient got into feed for food producing animals, creating significant food safety concerns. Regulators temporarily stopped many animals from going to market, and owners of affected livestock and poultry bore the brunt of that costly stoppage. It was only after scientists thoroughly investigated the problem and found no threat to human health that the animals were finally released. You also have a role in medicated feed. Medicated feed products are safe for animals and do not result in harmful drug residues when done right, when you follow the label directions. For the feed manufacturer, following the regs, that is, the current good manufacturing practices for medicated feeds, means that the food from the treated animals will not contain harmful drug residues. Errors in formulating, mixing, or feeding could result in a breakdown of the process and harm the animals or the people who consume products from them. Congress passed laws to give us at the Center for Veterinary Medicine the responsibility to help ensure safe feed. We implement these laws by writing regulations to provide details on how to enforce the letter of the laws as well as the spirit. Our intent is to ensure the safety of the feed to help protect the health of the animals and the health of the people. But our system of laws and rules only goes so far in protecting against errors and unexpected threats. The best defense against an animal feed disaster is you. I'm gonna go ahead and weigh up the 66 pounds. Alert and attentive feed ingredient manufacturers. Turn it on feeder one. And livestock and poultry producers. We rely on each and every one of you. If you'd like to find out more about feed safety, please visit the FDA website, www.fda.gov, and click on the animal and veterinary link. I hope you've enjoyed this video, which illustrates the importance of everyone's role in ensuring the safety of feed for the animals that provide the food we eat every day. We truly live in a global village, and no matter where we are, we should never have to question the safety of the meat, milk, and eggs that we eat. We thank each and every one of you for all that you do every day.